Welcome to uh, al the Algebra Final Review. This is Standard 10, and this is Part 2, Problem 2. And uh, so just be aware of that. We're just going to go really quickly over this problem. Um, basically, it's about Zoe and her flipping pancakes, and they give us a quadratic that models it. And what I'm going to suggest that you do is that on your calculator that you go to the um, I'm going to suggest that you go to the y equals button right here and go ahead and type this in negative 9x squared plus 9.8x and remember that this is where you get your x is this button right here right next to the green one okay now if I do that and I tell it to graph you get a graph like this. I'm going to zoom in on that little space right there. Uh, zoom box. Remember zoom box then you move the cursor to where you want to start your box. Press enter and then start drawing your box with the arrow keys and once you have it about where you want it. Okay. Now this box models the height, so the Y is going to be the height, and this direction is going to be the time. Basically, I can start looking and I can see the model, and they ask us some questions, like how long the pancake was in the air. Well, zero is going to represent ground level, and so if I want to know how long it was in the air, it's where it started from here, and then how long did it take to get to here. If I trace it, I can get an approximate answer. Somewhere between 1.07 and 1.1. And I'm betting that it's probably about 1.1. Let's check it by doing this. Um, I'm going to go back. I'm going to go back and I'm going to type the, the rule out, but I'm going to put 1.1 in its place, in the place of x plus 9.8 times 1.1 equals 0.88. So I'm still a little bit off. Okay. Um, so let's try just like 1.2. I'm going to come back and I'm going to change everything to 1.2. And I'm still a little high. So let's go back to the graph. Let's see what we've got here. Trace. Somewhere between 1.1 and 1.07. Okay. Anyway, if we... Um, there is a feature on your calc that you can use that asks you to find the zero. And we've called them that before. You have to choose zero, move it to a little bit above the spot, or to the right of the spot, press enter. Sorry, left of the spot and press enter, then go to the right of it and go to about where you think it is. And it'll tell you that it's actually at about 1.08. So 1.1 would have been a really good guess as to about how much time it took from the graph. Okay? Then it says, at what time does the pancake stop going up and start coming down? Well, that would be, if I trace it, that's going to be at about the top. And I can see that that is about... See at what time? So times are x's. So at about a half a half a second is when it's at its top, and when it starts coming down, it asks how high it was, and the height that it went was 2.66, probably about 2.7. They ask us to draw a sketch of the graph, and what I would suggest is that we know this is at 1.1. We know that that's about 0.53 and 2.66, and that's at 0, 0, and that gives you a good set of points. You could also trace and find some of your other points along the um, curve to do. Like here's a point that's at about 1 and 1 and you could put that in there. Okay, good luck with that and good luck on the test.